We are live, ladies and gentlemen. At least I hope so. We'll find out shortly, surely. I just went live though, so... Oh yeah, my producer has let me know that she just got the notification. Um, much excite. Bit of a su surprise stream. Usually it's, I think it's the second one this week. Didn't initially plan this, but I'm a fortunate boy. It's a very busy week for me. Tomorrow I'll be performing with Cezanne Azel at the uh, Voltkospies. Um, thank you. And I, uh, as well as with Reike Kleinans, which is going to be loads of fun. Um, as a whole day, it's one of the best gigs of the year. I <laughs> jokingly told people, the day I stopped getting that gig um, is the day I quit music. <laughs> then I'm going to, then I'll become a streamer. Because there's no reason for me to perform live if I can't do gigs like the Volsko Space. Um, anyway, we are going to be doing some guitars. I probably would have done this off stream. Um, but I've been having so much fun with this song. I was programming drums and doing some arrangement. I was like, this, this is one I want to share. Um, let me just leave. There we go. Um, I don't know if she's on yet. Let's. When she is on, yeah. Oh, technically her name is Joanna. I've been calling her Lauren. Yeah, you have. I realized that's I that's her surname. A, a few times I I've, do like. I just I think I'm just Joanna. like I just read it the wrong. I think I just read <laughs> it wrong, um, first couple of times and then it's stuck in my head, and you know how how the brain is, um, but that's not important. Um, oh, there we are. Right. Yeah, yeah. There's a there's a couple of seconds delay. Anyway, that's not the point. Um, anyway, let me know when she's. I will. Okay. Um, feel free to yell at me in the chat, anyone who's watching. Uh, I'll try and constructively yell at me in the comments. Um, I plan on trying to monitor the chat as much as I can tonight. Um, but yeah, we'll have a listen to the original version. She's posted this on her channel. It's a beautiful acoustic, like just piano and vocal. Gorgeous, nothing wrong with that. Uh, but recently she was like, do you want to do like a heavier, slightly heavier rock version that's more in line with uh, some of the other stuff we've been working on together? And I said, yeah, heck yeah. Um, so I've just been spending some time programming drums and writing the guitars. So tonight's going to be a little bit of acoustic, loads of electric um, but, uh, yeah, let's just jump right into it. I'm going to play the original. You'll see I've copy pasted some, like the original intro is a bit short to my liking. So I've copy pasted some of that. Um, but that's not important for now. I want 
Take my hand, here we go. You help me carry these burdens I hold. Put a big break here because I want something massive. You understand, came with the plan. Pulled me to my feet, saved me from me. I didn't know. I was never alone. Oh, beautiful work. I don't actually know who did the piano and guitar work on this one. Let me just check if it's on the on the YouTube. Yeah, uh, Jana, please let me know if, um, like, who did the piano? Because lovely work. Um, now, not to diminish the original soft acoustic ballad vibe. I quite like it. But I'm going to go a bit more in the direction of, well, like, I almost want to say a little bit of Alter Bridge, a little bit of Breaking Benjamininess, just a whole lot of classic rock. Um, but yeah, basically, here's what I've got so far. It's mostly just drums and vocals. But, um, as I mentioned, I'm going to have double B. Somebody in the chat definitely let me know if uh, there's any. I just want to turn this off. Um, Did you Did you hear background noise? In my stream. Yeah, it's like a, a melodic thing. Like no, don't stop. You're not funny. <laughs> it sounds like a guitar. <laughs> You're not being funny. That makes, it's don't make me stress. You when don't make me stress about technical <laughs> difficulties and then just say it's the sound of things. But no. That's a recipe. That's a recipe for divorce, my good lad. <laughs> Love you. Oh, yeah. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm gonna. I'm gonna turn you back because I'm gonna go make us some chicken and salmon. Chicken. That's gonna become a thing on stream. As usually, I'm streaming while either food is being ordered or food is being prepared. So if it ever seems like I'm rushing to complete these, um, that's probably why. I'm gonna bring down the camera a little. Um, so you can see some of the guitar. Yeah. Excuse the the angle. Yeah. For acoustics, I'm going to be working with my Cole Quark. This is kind of my main workhorse of an acoustic guitars. This is what I, I use for live, almost exclusively. It's got an ins like an incredibly cool pickup system. Uh, which I'm not really utilizing tonight because um, it's all mic tone up in here. Um. So for the intro, um, the original is C sharp. Just the second repeat. So it's it's down the A. C and then that G 
over E. A. Back to the verse. So let's jump right into that, guys. What do you think? Um, be sure if you're watching this in, in post, be sure to uh, let me know in, in the comments what I'm doing wrong. But yeah, I'm, like I said, as I was arranging this, just I have so many ideas. And again, no no shade to the guy who did the original chords at all. Um, genuinely, I think he did a really good job. But I am going to be uh, adjusting some chords here and there. Because I can't help myself. I can't help myself. not on testing one two I hope there's not a delay between the door and the thing I think I'm fine with that. Oh, at this point I'm going to mute the original because we're starting to get some clashes. almost immediately. Mm -hmm. So I do want some of that piano. I'm considering adding some piano again and having that same piano riff. Something like that. Having something like oh. maybe that'll work. What do you think? Let's let's do that immediately. What's the most kind of I want to translate the, the piano iness of it as much as I can? That'll do, I think. Yes. Yeah, that's the one I want. Yes. Sorry, I'm going to mute that piano again. about my adjusted chords. That's lovely with a little bit of a little bit of naughty reverb. I think that's gonna be real pretty. I think that's gonna be real pretty.
have some big full on strums, strums for that, uh, the rest of the intro. Now I'm thinking, uh, electric guitar is going to feature mostly here, but I do want this kind of, um, bed of acoustic guitar to live throughout the whole song, um, especially in the, the more chill moments. Something you'll hear is that uh, that's something um, uh, I definitely I'm I'm planning to emphasize a bit more in the the electric, but I've got this. Uh, I kind of got this idea for this recurring reoccurring bass line uh, thing in the electrics. So I don't want to mess that up. That's that's very eighties kind of situation. Yeah. This is double that. Thing you'll notice I kind of adjust I adjusted the voicings a little for the second time around um, it's mostly just to create an extra little bit of width 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 what a weird word eh one goes up one goes down Joanna was nice enough to send me Here in a dream I lie awake in bed Nice enough to send me the isolated vocal tracks which I really appreciate because um, that does help a lot so we can have the vocals without the original. As I said, I'm going to be adjusting a lot of the um, I'm going to be adjusting a lot of the, the chord or the, the harmony um with her, uh, that goes with her voice. Here in a dream, I lie awake in bed. Sun rise and sets. I'll stay here in my head. The days come and go, but time moves so slow. Just let me out. Let I'm gonna keep the verse acoustic because it's a bit more picky. I'm gonna keep that center in the middle. Um, I don't wanna. A. I wanna be lazy and not need to double track it. <laughs> but um, uh, I wanna. I wanna. Again, what's the word I'm looking for? No, I want to make sure that when we get into the chorus, it gets nice and big and nice and wide. Um, I realize now my um, my face or my my main face track is in the top where all the action is. 
So let's change that. Cool. Now you get to see more of the door. I think that's a little better. Ooh, so slow. Just let me out. Okay, so now I want to create some tension. Uh, we ended on the A. That's the fourth for those keeping track. Let's try this one. Just let me out. Let me go. No one could carry these burdens I hold. You don't understand. That. Just let me out. Now it is up to Lauren. Uh, oh, sorry, uh, Chad. <laughs> If she wants to re-record her vocal for the final version of the kind of rock ballad -y version, um, uh, I wouldn't think it's necessary. I like her vocal takes on this version, but a lot of artists do like to have like the acoustic or or the stripped down version and the full band version to have a different feel. So that, that'll be up to her. I do think her vocal performance is great in this. Just one. let me out. Uh -oh. Add a little, maybe that should be on the electric, but I don't want to forget that idea. Just let me out, let uh, like a cool. Yeah. Just let me out, let me go. No one could catch. That's a bit country. Just let me out. That'll do, that'll do, that'll do. Let's hear that. So slow. Just let me out. Let me. Uh. Yeah. So slow. Just let me out. Let me go. No one could catch. So And she sang ho. Now that I uh, can't okay, so, uh, uh, We were on that B chord, so that's quite resolved. But I want to add a little bit of tension. So if I put that over the, I believe the A. Is it the A I landed on? Yeah. looking for that resolution but we're not there yet no 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 I will not grant thine resolution this early in the song so we got this kind of tense yeah we got this kind of tense and it's looking for that kind of thing and I will not grant it until nearly the very end of the song for the chorus, I'm going to go pretty much with the original, I quite like that. Classic at the four chord, very much uh, a, a classic for a reason. You don't understand, there is no plan. They did something fun. You don't under the way with it. I carry this load and I'm alone. I like.
like that. What's that remind me of? Maybe it's reminding me of a Celine Dion song or something. I don't. I don't know. Maybe it's just in my head. Let's do this. You don't understand. I did not. I did not come in with confidence. You don't understand. No, I don't know why. My brain was just wasn't there. I was focusing on other things. Focus. You don't understand. There is no plan. You don't understand There is no plan No help on the way With each passing day I carry this stone And I'm alone How did I Fun times I'm still keeping it quite chill I'm still I'm not I don't want to go overboard too quickly Um I think most of the electric guitar also is going to be quite clean at this point. I want it to grow and get more aggressive as we go. How did I break the one piece that can't be fixed? My reflect. Yeah, let me quickly see what happens if I just copy paste that original verse. Um, <laughs> Excuse me. How did How did I break the, the one guitar, piece that can't be fixed? My reflections are happy. Person that I miss and I can't control. Record some person that I miss, and I can't control where my mind goes. Person that I miss, and I can't control where my mind goes. Just some tension now i have to let me put the camera on my face uh i have to watch myself this song i can't go full genty gent gent i can't ones and zeros are not allowed here i will be recording with the seven string um but that's because i have some chords in mind um some big fat uh seven string chords that i, that I really want to put on this um uh, and we're in C sharp minor, so I can reach some cool things on the seven string. I would not be able to otherwise. But I had to stop myself the whole time. I was like, remember, this is heavy rock, not progressive metal. So I had to stop myself a couple of times. But someplace in the song, I'm allowing myself some some cool progginess, and this is one of those times. Uh, so the original chord, the the chords for the. Just let me out, let me go. Just let me out, let me go. No, I wanted to end. You don't understand. I don't want to end on that kind of happy chord. I want to end. Get some tension up in there, but we'll figure it out along the way. Let's let's have some fun. Just let me out. Let me go. No one could carry these burdens I hold. You don't understand. That's like.
like a B flat over F sharp, which is fun. And I think it works with because he's singing a B, uh, an F sharp. So I thought maybe I can get away with that one. And then a clean break on that. Uh, you don't understand. Back into the chorus. Let's get. Just let me out. Let me go. No one could carry these burdens. I hold. Oh, it's, it's really hard to play that chord cleanly. Um, I might, I might cheat and play. I might cheat a little. We are in the studio. You're allowed to cheat in the studio. Um, oh, it's it sort of uh, that B flat. I realize now it's sort of turning it into an F sharp, uh, F major. Technically, we're going to an F sharp major, but with sl some slightly more. Burdens, I hold. I've decided that's too crunchy. As I said, you gotta hold yourself accountable. So I'm just oh, gonna go to a nice F sharp minor nine me sussy guy. Let me go. No one could carry these burdens. I hold. You don't understand. That doesn't feel satisfying enough. I think I'm gonna do like look at me going completely back on what I said because the I want attention I want it sounds like the setting I want attention that's also true a minor that's lovely let's try that let me go no one could count A bit crunchy. What's what's the relationship there? I quite like that. Let's try. Let me go. No one could carry these burdens. I hold. You don't understand. Let's think about it. Burdens I hold. Yeah, I quite like the tension again with the electric guitar going back to that C sharp minor. I believe our chorus should still be fine. Uh, that's over here. Copy pasta. You don't understand. Uh, you don't understand. There we go. You don't cool idea uh, and that's very this is very breaking Benjamin I, I I do admit but yeah something like that going into that this bridge section um, so I admit I'm sort of ripping all that off. From, I've been listening to a lot of Breaking Benjamin. You can't help if you listen to a lot of like good bands, and you enjoy their music. It's gonna influence you a little, um, at least stylistically. Um, you're still there. Um, let me know in the comments down below what's your favorite ba Breaking Benjamin album. It's one of those bands that every time I talk to someone about the band and they like them they're like oh yeah i really like their their older stuff but i don't really like their newer stuff and that was interesting and that's kind of normal for most bands 
is what their newer stuff constitutes is different from person to person. So for some people, pretty much just the first album, that's their old stuff, and everything after that's the new stuff, because they grew up in the 90s. Uh, but for me, like pretty much the only album that counts as their new stuff is their most recent one. I discovered them somewhere in high school, a friend of mine, and at that point, most of their discography, I think I... I've been in a I've been alive long enough, but I've listened to their music only long enough for maybe for one or two album releases. So for most, like most of the stuff that a lot of people they don't like, because it's not not the same as their old stuff. Um, that was the old stuff when I found them, and that's fine. You're allowed to like things, anyway. With each passing day, I carry this love and die. some ideas for this. Let's just double that. With each passing day, I carry this and I'm alone. Trying to survive. Trying to survive. The original uh, had Trying to survive, God, I just wanted back to the minor, but again, I want to I want to um, add some movement um, to this one. Hi, Joanna, nice to see you. Nice uh, high spaced out three three uh, three one one. Um, uh, I see. Uh, I believe your name is Kyle. Um, but yeah, Breaking Benjamin, definitely go check him out. Um, if I was to give a recommendation to a song, like I think they're one of their big songs that's like, sorry, tangent, but every band has one or two songs that even non fans know, and for them, I will not bow is like a big one that was in a cert, like in a, in a in a movie soundtrack to the uh, Bill, Bruce Willis film Surrogates, uh, a, I would say like B tier action movie that I quite liked, uh, for its concept when it came out. Why was it? A young person, so like I, uh, you know, there's a phase for every young film lover where you're smart enough to know that there are good movies and bad movies, but you're not quite smart enough to know which is which yet. <laughs> um, so there's a lot of like dumb action movies from the early 2000s that I am insanely nostalgic about. Anyway, that's not the point. Um, <laughs> They have a lot of like cool riffs, like da -da 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 -da. fun. I genuinely think they did a lot of riffs that today would say, "Oh, is that like gentle proggy?" But this was in two thousand and two or something, so they were a bit of ahead of their time. Um, uh, they've also got some great acoustic versions, but I will not bow. Dear agony, that's an. I think that's the name of my album. There's one of their deeper cuts, uh, uh, Dance with the Devil. Uh, you and I, and we dance with the devil tonight. Don't you dare look at him in the eye. As we dance with the devil tonight. Yeah. I don't think it's a necessarily a miss. So called, also an excellent song. Um, that's I think that was also one of their big hits that a lot of people really liked. Um, what album was so called from? Anyway, fun tangent about Breaking Benjamin. Like I said, they were a, a band for me in early high school, early to mid high school that I listened daily because this was before, not before the internet, but the internet in at least in South Africa where I stay was a very much a thing you could maybe have it at home, your dad had it at work, and you had one rich friend who had internet. But I did not have internet at home. So the way I would get albums is either I'd buy the physical album and I'd rip it onto our computer, again, no internet, and then transfer it to my phone, or you'd get it slightly dodgily from your friend on a USB, like a flash drive. So the amount of band, like albums, like early 2000s rock stuff, I don't know the band's names, 
I don't know the titles of the songs. I just, like, I got a USB stick with 100 folders, and all of them are just marked, maybe the band's name, and then 01 track 01. That's the, and then 02 track 02, etc. So then I'd have this massive folder of music, untitled, and I'd just go, I'd put that in the playlist and listen to it all day. And, um... Yeah, definitely before Spotify and such. Um, I, yeah, I, a part of me is nostalgic about that, that era for just, I feel like I discovered so many bands and didn't think about like, oh, what subgenre are they or what's their audience or what, it, like I just, a friend of mine would just go check out this band. Here's a flash drive or here's a CD I burnt. Remember back in the day, lol, LimeWire. <laughs> um, but yeah, a part of me is nostalgic for how I discovered bands back in the day. Now, I do love Spotify and sites like Spotify because I discover so many bands just because of the recommendation. The algorithm is so freaking good for like, oh, you currently are listening to Our Last Night. Well, here is Our Last Night Radio and here's 20 other bands that are kind of in that vibe. Um, I could not have dreamt in a million years that that would have been possible when I was a young warthog. Anyway, going to Trying to survive, God, I just want to die. Waiting for the oh. end, then I shut my eyes. This is like the darkest point of the song, lyrically. You know, like, waiting to, hoping to die, shutting my eyes and stuff, and we're heading into the instrumental. Uh, again, that wasn't present in the original, uh, but... I, you know me, I can't deny. Uh. Uh, this one. Trying to survive, God, I just want to die. Waiting for the end, then I shut my eyes. Yeah, something like that, a little bit more metal. Um, let's, let's try it out. Trying to survive, God, I just want to die. Because I don't want to mess with her melody trying to survive yeah yeah that's nice and tense uh More tense. Trying to survive, God, I just want to die. Waiting for the end, then I shut my eyes. Mess with it, have uh, creatively open. Like, I think I. If, mm. Trying to survive. Oh, that's pretty. Because I could, I might add harmonies onto that, and I really like that. I don't want to lose that specific reality. I'm not, it's too late to turn back now. But here, I feel like um, the kind of idea I've got for the instrumental, not as shreddy as some of the other stuff I've done. Um, uh, 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 yeah. Let's, let's hear that out. Something like Let's see what we got. 
I didn't come in with confidence. I apologize. Take my hand, here we go. I might do a little bit of shreddiness, like into it, like do yeah, a little bit of a lead in. Um, oh, don't know what more feels good. Um, yeah, I, I also slightly again, I'm in the right generation for most of those uh piracy adjacent sites like LimeWire. But again, I didn't have internet. Again, so that's the weirdest thing about South Africa. We have some of the trimmings of first world countries, you know, uh, having to pay too much taxes. And, <laughs> and uh, we have a lot of infrastructure now. But we're, I would say, 10 years behind like the US or um, oh God, the UK and Australia in certain things, not everything. Um, and I can't 100% say why. Um, a lot of people blame our government. Uh, this is not the place to get political, and I'm not gonna. Um, but yeah, there's weird little things where if you're... Like, most of our media comes from overseas. Most of my favorite bands and favorite movies we see are from overseas. Um, doesn't mean... We have a big music industry. I, myself, am a part of a... a you know, like, a lot of work that you know is completely local but uh as a person who works with international artists through fiber and you know i've collaborated on youtube and stuff with a couple of people there is this kind of weird disconnect to a lot of people my age in regards to the like oh 90s kids will remember and i was like wow that's that's interesting and then sometimes i say kids who grew up in the 80s will get this and I'm like, I didn't grow up in the 80s, but like, I get, I do get it. Because in South Africa, that might have been more of a thing here. Um, like, you know that sound of like the, like a weird dial-up internet sound? That was like normal for a lot of guys my age. But if you live in the US, slightly older. Not, not a lot older. Um, but I think fast internet speeds being available to everyone which just wasn't the thing until i was almost out of high school um but that's not really uh, i will say that has one big positive effect and it means that when i eventually did jump on the internet when i eventually did get into youtube and did, eventually did get into a lot of my favorite bands a lot of the groundwork had been laid by other youtubers and other creators on the internet um the better part of 10 years ago, uh, I didn't really see a lot of the internet in its infancy. Uh, but if you want to get philosophical about it, technically the internet is still very young. Anyway, that's not the point. Let's do this. Got my eye. Take my hand, here we go. Yes, I'm, I'm very happy with that. I'm very happy. Now, I just want to quickly program the drums for that little break. Um, now, let's finish first. Let's finish first. Let's finish first for, before we mess up the mic placement. You take my hand, here we go. You help me carry these burdens. 
You take my hand, here we go. You help me carry these burdens I hold. Now we're gonna get that You resolution. take my Now we're gonna get that resolution I spoke of earlier. It's so interesting I saw you recently. Uh, oh yeah. <laughs> um sorry my YouTube chat. I'm really glad that I can be of of use in regards to interesting information. I do think uh, if I had my way, at least in regards to YouTube, uh, music would make me money, and being able to tell people about music is all I really, you know, like, I want to be able, that's what I want to do for a living, but I can't make money just sitting, hey, welcome to my TED Talk, so, that's why I love, that's why I started this, this, uh, what did I call it, P Peter's, P Peter's Process Podcast, whatever, um, uh, patent pending, um, is so I have an opportunity while I'm working, while I'm doing the thing I actually get paid for, um, I can have an opportunity to tell people about uh, a bit of the process. And because I think I know a lot. I, every now and then I have a conversation with a young musician. It's like it's just such a weird world, but there's so like music is so weird. But there's so many like sh not shortcuts, but it like, uh, most of us don't know what we're doing. Most professional people don't know what they're doing. <laughs> I want more people to know that. Um, so the little bit, and everyone's a, like super gatekeepy about the little bit they do know. So anyway, that's not that's not the point. The point is a little bit of music theory. Now I want to bring in that resolution that I spoke of earlier. That was uh, I wanted to stop that. I didn't want to give that that nice. Um, Res not the word the opposite of dissonance. It's not resonance. It's whatever. Peaceful vibes. I'm gonna give a little bit of that now because we're heading into the positive vibes of the song. Anyway. You take my hand, here we go. You help me carry these burdens I hold. So that, like, I've kind of been keeping that a secret. Um, that's the big break I was feeling. This is like, I would say, you know that moment in I Will Always Love You? Do, do, and I, I yeah. will always love you. It's sort of what I'm aiming for, just a little more aggressive. You take my hand, here we go. You help me carry these burdens I hold. Nice and big, um, yeah. The, and again, the electric guitar is just pulling all the weight on this song. You understand? Came with the plan. Pull me to my feet, save me from me. I didn't know I was never alone. Never alone. Oh, 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 I did a little bit of a, a naughty copy paste. Oh, I was never. <laughs> Another moderator just handled this. Um, uh, it seems that my stream has decided to automatically stop some comments from coming through. I'm not exactly sure why. Anyway. I have a little bit of tension still at the end. Never alone. So we need to end on the B, guys. We need to end on the B. End to the B, end to the B. You understand? Came with the plan. Pull me to my feet. Save me from me. I, I, I'm also emphasizing. Save me from me. Uh, 
，呃，是。Yeah, I wanted to like、uh, the guitar is gonna have a big moment there. Anyway. You understand? Came with the plan. Pull me to my feet. Save me from me. I didn't know. I was never alone. Never alone. I'll keep it up until there. I messed up. I was never alone. Uh, 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 I remember what I wanted to do. Never alone. Never alone. I think I need another bar. I think that's the problem. Never alone. Never alone. Yeah, I, ended, I, I ended it too quickly. Uh, let me move this around. We'll figure that out shortly. We'll figure this out. Yeah. It seems right at the top. What we want, I can't tell. Add some crazy drum solo there or something. And I think then this fits in there. Maybe let's let's hear if that works now. I didn't know I was never alone, never alone. That's closer to what I wanted. I can't tell because、uh, I wanted that little. Might be cool.、Uh, got an idea. It might be a little risky. Let's hear if it works. No, that's not right. That's all I want.、Okay. It's an F sharp major. Let's let's hear. I've got this idea in my head, but I I'm not sure if it's working yet. Never alone. Never alone. Basically, I think I've got the idea down. So it's like. Drums continue. Yeah, that's the one. Basically, yeah, that's that's sort of the idea. I'll 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 play that together now.、Uh, we need some more groove, baby. We need some more groove. That's where it ends. That's where it ends. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. 
We're almost there, boys. Again, uh, it's up to ja Jana if she wants to adjust this melody slightly. But that's basically the idea. Uh, let's record the lost guitar. You understand, came with the plan. Hold me to my feet, save me from me. I didn't know I was never That's the chord progression, guys. Also, for, for those who have been watching the stream for a while, uh, and even if this is your first one, um, I've been experimenting with, um, uh, excuse me, I've been experimenting with doing some of the more boring things off stream. Um, oh, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, like like programming the MIDI and stuff like that doing some of that uh, programming the MIDI and the drums and stuff like that off stream because when I watched back some of the streams I'm like that can get a bit boring but I uh, I also had a conversation with a friend he's like he quite likes that bit that bit's very interesting uh, to him. So, yeah, let me know. Is the warts and all approach and you know, everything is on the stream and it's five hours long, is that exciting to people? Um, or is this where I've kind of done the drums beforehand and um, just do the guitars? Uh, I, I guess it's I find the guitars more interesting. Um, more interesting to watch. Uh, when I'm when I'm watching back to it, then again, to each his own. So for those who've been following the channel for a while, recognize the seventh string. I know I've been plugging this a lot in the last couple of streams, but I recently uh, made a video about why I love seven string guitars, and I think it's one of my best videos. So feel free to go watch it if you haven't already. Give me a sec. Sorry, I'm just looking for. My footstool. I think I've mentioned this before, but I, I had a little bit of classical training, which is where a lot of music theory comes from. But this thing has saved my life so often. Uh, you can't really see it, but you put it under your foot, hence the name footstool, <laughs> and the cause and purpose of this is so I can um, wear the guitar in a more ergonomic uh, posture and that means that, like if you sit in classical posture like this instead of having a guitar, a guitar like this you can you can immediately see I have to strain to hold the guitar but if it's like this it's already in my kind of in the exact same posture anyway we'll be doing some seven string and I'm quite excited about this because I have some big ideas let's uh, let's jump into that now for tone, um, I had a little bit of internal debate because for a lot of the, the heavier genre stuff, I would immediately go to, where is my uh, neural DSP stuff? My trial version of the Tomorello ran out. I do actually think that would have been best for this one. Um, so subscribe and donate money so I can buy more plugins. Um, the go but the Tomorello, just not versatile enough for me to justify buying it right now. But for heavier tones, I'll often go to the Archetype Nolly, uh, which has recently gotten an app update for Apple Silicon, which I'm really excited about. Haven't downloaded it yet <laughs> uh, because I, I don't want to 
take time to do that now. But um, one of my favorite presets, mini, 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 metal rhythm. This is an absolute Great sounding plugin, um, Metal Rhythm 2. So it's, what's great is these presets. I really like that. But this song isn't really a metal song, it's a rock song. Um, so I might actually just go to this amp. Let's see what, what presets do we have. I haven't looked through this one in a while, because um, for my everyday use, um, I've mostly been using um, I'll tune now. That's quite lovely. Yeah, sorry, it's out of tune though. That's the problem. Um, my daily use for like gigs and stuff i've been using the also the neural dsp the uh tone king imperial which to, for my money is an excellent really versatile plugin i get i can use it for a lot of country and a little bit of rock uh, i think for clean guitars i'll probably actually use that for the clean guitars on uh, this project um yeah, clean guitars definitely. Why am I struggling so much? Am I tuning the wrong one? I'm sorry. This is why people subscribe, right? This is why people started following this. This is this is the in the quality entertainment you 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 come for, right? This is the good stuff. Right here, right now. Um, a little more vintage sounding. get some harmonics in there yeah it might be a little too vintagey oh let's put some gain on it I wanted to use the seven string so I can get nice and low. Um, yeah, that's the one. I think that's the one for me. Uh, at least for now. We can experiment, the, uh, we can experiment all night long. Um, let's go from the beginning. Nice. Oh, we haven't really used that opening riff. Is it too aggressive? Maybe I don't know. We'll find out. Uh, that's that's another thing. I keep saying this. That's another great thing about using plugins. No loud noise in the room, so it saves my ears. But also, um, uh, no loud noise in the room. But also, if I decide the tone isn't working for me, isn't working for the song, I can always tweak it later. 
might adjust the tone for the second one so you see that little loading time there apparently the new update will will kind of make that loading time nice and quick which is great news for me um. <laughs> you just want da 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 no yeah let's do that again but this time even <laughs> that's all i wanted is that and i'm gonna have the lead guitar do that too that up a little. Um, hey. She is, yeah. She's on stream. Well, at least she was at some point. Maybe she's... Yeah, what do you have? Do you want? Um... You just want to include some rats. You just wanted <laughs> to include some rats I for the people. I feel like now it's Let's... actually appropriate. Yeah. Let me switch to the main camera. We've got some babies. Hey, baby. <laughs> Look at that one. Look at that one. Is... Oh! That's a sable Siamese. <clears throat> and this is a sofa beauty. Come on. Let's see that for a sec. Mm -hmm. I think the focus is near my face. There we go. Yeah, uh -huh. yeah we got some we got some interaction in the chat. Hey Richard. Hi, thank you so much for checking in. Yeah, Lauren is like, hey how are we? <laughs> yeah, no. We we love them as well. If like if I wasn't scared of accidentally like dropping them or something, I would love to have a, a rat just always on me on stream. I mean you could totally have one of the adult ones with you. I'm worried they get on my guitar at some way and get hurt. I don't want to accidentally. Are you comfortable eating on stream? Because I'm making dumplings. Oh, I love it. Bring me like two dumplings and something to drink and I'll okay. maybe eat on stream while I listen to it, okay. uh, cool. listen back. Um, never been confronted with the question, am I comfortable eating on stream? I'm, I guess we'll find out. Um, usually, the only reason I'm not comfortable eating even in public is the beard. Because that can be both blessing and a curse. Um, so I go. Let's make a lead tone. Let's make that slightly more. Actually, got a great lead tone on this plugin. Um, so back to factory settings, uh, default setting. Okay, a little bit of a tutorial. So you go to the clean amp, the clean amp. I know a lot of people don't expect that. Not too much gain. Uh, dial in your treble and stuff the way you like it 
Uh, we can look at reverbs and stuff in a sec. And then overdrive one, which is a little bit of a tumor, tube screamery situation, not too high. Gain on this one, also not too high. We can adjust that to taste. Let's see how that sounds already. Actually, I don't know how that sounds with this guitar. I, I, I found this kind of tone uh, with my other guitar, so maybe it sounds bad. <laughs> sounds actually better I almost prefer this to the other one um, <laughs> Eugene thanks for dropping in extra <laughs> quick <Cook> dumplings <laughs> um, uh, you should make yourself dumpling you know what everyone should get themselves some dumplings and we'll enjoy some dumplings together on on on, uh, on stream um, <laughs> That's a bit too much delay. Let's let's hear. Let's find out. I can move this now closer to my face because I'm not recording acoustic anymore. Can everyone still hear me fine? It's not too loud, not too quiet. Hope not. Um, is that fine? Yeah. This tone already I'm gonna have lots of fun with with lead on this That's exactly the one. Just need to play that cleanly. Can definitely play that a little cleaner, but let's do that. good let's hear that so my worry is this doesn't reoccur you can't do that you can't have an opening riff as this catchy <laughs> oh, no, that note should continue Is this all for me? Yeah. Yo, you've, you've literally brought enough that everyone who's currently on stream could have gotten. I'm, I'm, I tried to be more careful. I'm really glad I didn't mess the sauce. Um, Fortunately, I put it in a plate. Thank you, baby. You're welcome, baby. Much appreciated. That's, this is like, that's very streamer, like Twitch streamer vibes to, <laughs> to have Asian food. Is that, <laughs> is that stereotypical? Because It was the easiest thing 
to make for like a, a, a starter because yeah. like Yeah. But yeah, every, every streamer I watch, if they eat, they do noodles or something, which is yeah. hilarious. Anyway. Yeah. Exactly like that. I do think I'll clean guitars I'm gonna do with my other guitar. Here in a dream, mm -hmm. I lie awake in bed. On the way home. How now I think I'm gonna take that intro riff and put it somewhere again. I'm not sure where. Because that intro riff only happens once now, and I'm very upset with myself that I didn't plan for this. But it's gonna happen again, somewhere. I'll figure that out. I'm not gonna sit and copy paste things now. Anyway, got some dumplings, got some soy sauce up in here. Thank you very much to my wonderful wife. Cheerio, guys. Hope you have a good one. Let's listen to actually. So you don't just have to watch me eat. Let's listen to that intro as is right now. should only come in at the chorus again uh darn it i picked cook ramen instead of dumplings <laughs> <laughs> yeah i know uh spicy curry is pretty good though most asian food is excellent like you can't go wrong my wife and i had um indian cuisine the other day um and as people have joked a lot south africa is home to it's gonna sound racially insensitive, but it, home to a lot of <laughs> Indian people, uh, and that's good. Um, Trevor Noah at some point pointed out, and I did fact check him on this. Uh, Durban in South Africa is the place that has the most Indians, second only to India, which is crazy. And I used to live in that area, so if you went out and it wasn't McDonald's or Spur, or like some kind of franchise, if you wanted to go out and not just for burgers, you got Indian food. At least in, in kind of my group of friends. Um, so if you and a couple of friends wanted to go out, have some drinks, um, and eat, uh, again, something else than burgers. Might have been pizza, but it was likely going to be Indian food. Um, and my wife uh, and I love making sushi. She's really good at it. She kind of got me into it. Because I used to... I used to only eat sushi on occasions because it's quite expensive. I, I think that's true anywhere in the world. It's quite expensive because it's hard. It's not easy to make sushi. Um, it's quite involved. And it's not just the the price of the ingredients to have a guy make sushi for you. It makes sense that it's that expensive. But um, when we learned how to make it ourselves, yo, it's, I love sushi so much now. I'm thinking You don't understand with that chikitakaku Nice and big electric guitars on that um chorus One could carry these burdens I 
your donut. I think. Just let me out. Yeah, okay, probably in the prequels. Just let me out. Let me go. No one could carry these burdens I hold. You don't understand. So, yeah. That sounds about right. Right? Turn this up a little so we can actually hear what we're doing. Oh, so just let me out. Let me go. No one could care. Oh, so just let me the one oh, so. just let me out let me go no one could carry oh, so. just let me out let me go no one could carry these burdens I have. you don't Love me that um, T. That's the thesis. You don't understand. There is no plan, no help on the way. With each passing day, I carry this load. There's that. With uh. each <laughs> I carry this load and mm. you don't understand there is no plan no help on the way with each passing day I carry this load and I'm alone how did that's where the intro needs to happen again You don't understand There is no plan No help on the way With each passing day I carry this song And I'm alone How did I That's fun I think that's, that's pretty fun Again, I'm gonna I am definitely gonna refine the guitar tone a little It's feeling a little nothing at the moment um or at least it's not meshing with the rest of the song just yet um let's hear that let's listen to that uh chorus in total just let me out let me go no one could carry these burdens i have you don't Definitely gonna put the the intro riff here again. Not gonna waste our time with that now. Uh, what was that? Oh, that's an Alice Cooper song. Uh, yeah. To love me some poison up in here. Yeah. Now, definitely, uh, yeah, uh, professionally made sushi is still better to me. Because there's certain kinds of sushi, certain kinds of special fancy rolls that I can't make. Um, or I'm too lazy to make. Um, but yeah, so usually when my wife and I make sushi, we make enough for five people and it lasts us a day and a half. And it's mostly 
classic role, just California roles or whatever. My wife has has a, is a bit more adventurous with what she makes. We also love. Uh, I I learned a really cool recipe for like how to prepare bean curd now. Uh, so I've tried that and that's really fun. Um, there's a there's a, a specific kind of what's the word I'm looking for sushi recipe that apparently is like a South African invention that is re- I'm pretty re- that's pretty cool South Africa has invented a kind of sushi and I've, I've spoken to one or two people from overseas they've never heard of it but I can't remember the name now give me a sec it's my wife's favorite um, but it has like a sweet sauce on it and found out it's like basically like the topping that you put on malfa pudding I don't know what malfa pudding is in the US um, what's malfa pudding and like what would be a like an international equivalent? I don't think there is. There isn't. Re- it's a South African pudding, but wh- like, what is the? It's kind of like Christmas I don't know, pudding. It's like a caramelized pudding with cream. Um. Yeah. Malfa pudding. Yeah. California rolls. Those are the best. Uh, those are the easiest to make. What's and that? what's that? What's that? Yeah, because the the pud that they the make. The pudding on. Yeah, yeah. The That's Auntie Donna. To a, a malfa pudding. Yeah, the Auntie Donna sketch pud. They make a Christmas pudding that's very similar to malfa pudding, but not exactly. Biltong is the best version of South African... Yeah, Eugene, yeah, yeah. yeah. Biltong is the best version of South African version of sushi. Like, <laughs> I've, I've literally had people who sticky come to pudding, South Africa... Okay. And mm-hmm. Sticky pudding is a good one. Yeah, sticky pudding is I've, I've comparable, I've had people yeah. who visit South Africa, and then, like, when I talk to them later, they're like, I miss Biltong. <laughs> yeah, no, Biltong... And it's not... You, American jerky is not the like, same. Like, jerky, it's prepared different. Um, there's a joke somebody made. Jerky is prepared by taking a perfectly good piece of meat and having a New York cab driver sit on it for three months. That's how they make jerky. No, I'm kidding. Uh, I've had jerky. It's fine. It's yummy. But boltong is a different thing. Um, Eugene, I think you're right. Uh, I think sticky pudding, sticky toffee yeah. pudding is similar enough to malfa pudding for, like, uh, for argument's sake. How'd I get to malfa pudding? I can't remember. Um, you know how I told you about that female rat? Mm-hmm. Who somehow got out and was like outside of the mm-hmm. cage when I took a few mm-hmm. drinks. She has an escape hatch somewhere. She has a place. She, she has... was outside again just now, but yeah. only when she got food. So I think it's just like when she gets food, she desperately clambers mm-hmm. out of her escape hatch. Mm-hmm. I think I know where it is, so I think I can Hopefully find it. it up. Um, um, but fortunately, she doesn't just escape there. Because, yeah, our dogs would eat her. <laughs> I want to keep that vibe from the intro as much as I can throughout the uh, core. Uh, out, let me go. No one could carry these burdens. I um. Something like that. I'm, I'm kind of picturing that. Just let me Something, something to that effect, I would say. simple keep it simple like that's the thing is again a little bit of a advice for young guitarists um there's a temptation to do all your favorite licks when you're playing lead like it's i feel like a lot of guitarists they learn not to overplay when they're playing rhythm i would say fairly early and when you start getting mature enough to know okay cool time for me to chill back you usually go to rhythm but sometimes you need to play lead but still not overplay. And my work with Arku has, has helped that a lot because there's a cellist, there's a violin, there's a saxophone. All the good solos are being taken by the saxophone, so I don't even get solos most of the time, but it's fine. Just sitting that kind of worship. 
worshipy area there in the middle. You don't understand. Again, we're gonna go into the opening riff, uh, unless somebody in the chat tells me that it's dumb, then I'll do it off stream. Uh, <laughs> um, uh, you good? Yeah. Oh, oh, are you joining us? Yes. Uh, nice. It's just the chicken that needs to cook. <gasps> chicken. Twenty minutes or so. Chicken. So if anyone gets triggered by Samsung alarms, then I'm sorry for what's gonna happen in twenty minutes. My wife's like. I would say first viral, um, <laughs> real, real that I helped her like helped her shoot. But I that's at that point I just switched over to my new phone. So my old phone I'm using as like a alarm. I, okay, I don't know if anybody else does this, but I can't trust myself to wake up from an alarm. So if I need to wake up from an alarm, I put it on the old phone, chuck that on a desk somewhere far I away. Have a, I have an alarm that makes me complete a math question before I can. Yeah, we both it. suck at waking up. So. <laughs> When I have to get up, out of bed, then go deactivate the alarm. Anyway, I forgot about that, put it on the desk, didn't think about it. And then as we're shooting the reel, I don't even notice. There's an alarm going off because I had set it, again, probably for something in the oven. Yeah. So it's, it was it was great comment bait, though. Yeah, comment bait because everyone in the comment was just, Oh, Jay, the freaking uh, fr frick Samsung alarm. Somebody please turn off that Samsung alarm. Um, has anyone, hey, why has no one talked about the Samsung alarm? Everyone has been talking about the Samsung alarm! Um, so, I do, a part of me does feel guilty. But also not, because as you pointed out, it's great uh, comment bait. Mm. Uh, now we're going to go into the that he slightly heavier rhythm. I'm going to switch to the neck pickup, I think. <laughs> Get a little bit of that 2002 metalcore bullet for my Valentine vibe in there. Um, that's what I'm feeling. How did I break the one piece that can't be fixed? Why can't, my why can't I play guitar for a second here? Um, and turn all of these down. Something in that in that vibe. Oh, how did I break the one piece that can't be fixed? My reflect. There's another opportunity. <laughs> I have a kill switch on this guitar. Um, I I used to not get like, oh, why would you want a kill switch? And then th like that changed my life. The fact that like, oh, 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 string noise, kill switch, it's gone. It sh shuts up. That has changed my life at rehearsals as well, especially if you're playing a little heavier gain sound. You don't want that like. Um, What's the word I'm looking for? You don't want the, uh, like the, the sound of the guitar pickups. How did I break the one piece that can't be fixed? One piece 
things that can't be fixed. My reflect. That's lovely. Yeah, no, that's perfect. Um. Okay, let's do that twice more together. I wanted to add a little harmony there. Be fixed, my reflect. It is my job. Crazy. 50, 60 cycle hum. That's the word I was looking for. Thank you, Eugene. Um, yeah, I wish I had a kill switch on my, like on all my guitars, but I, I don't necessarily want it in the tone position. I would love like a, like maybe to here. I've seen some, I think like the Music Man maybe, ha uh, guitars maybe have one here. Because with my other guitar, you'll see it later. Uh, I've got the fiber stitch and I, I, I use my tone knob quite a lot now. Uh, look at me, big mature guitarist who actually uses his tone knob. So I wouldn't take that out and put it. I would love a kill switch here. And it, like, it sucks that this guitar doesn't have a tone knob because I think that adds a lot of versatility. Um. Yo, what's that? Da -da -da -da. That's the core. Those are the core. Guitar tone is bothering me a little when I go down. Just want to hear that. J 
just with the drums to make sure I'm as tight. I can already see some spots where I aren't tight. Um, let's let's hear that with the drums. <laughs> I do think that actually, the parts where it aren't tight, like, feel like What's that? That's not, that's not good. Which, which guitar was that? Is it you? No, that one's bad. Uh, let's hear, is this one fine? Both are bad. Let's just do that switch to the A again. In fact, let's just do it up until there. Let's just do that whole section again. And I can't control where my mind And I can't control where my mind goes I'm happy with that. I like the slide up from the uh, C sharp to the A. I quite like that. I'm gonna keep that. Control where my control where my on the snare. That's quite. I can't control where my mind. Right, did I do it? No, that doesn't. I can't control where. Did it? That looks that looks right. Um. And control where I'm not spaced out three 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 one one. That is indeed the Kim Possible. Uh, bloop 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 bloop. Uh, my wife and I are big fans. Um, that's her phone notification. And control. Tighter. Control where my mind goes. Just let me out, let me go. No one could carry these burdens I hold. Oh, yeah, forgot about that. It is nice. It's nice. Something a lot wrong along those lines. Just let me out, let me go. No one could carry these burdens I hold. You don't understand. Let me out. Something along those lines. Get a little bit of gentiness in there. Just let me out. Don't remember what I did the first time. Oh, no one could carry this. Let me go. Go. No one could carry this. I don't like it. I don't like it. Me out. Let me go. No one could. Yeah. Me out. Let me go. No one could carry this burden. That works for me. Those octaves sound, sound a little fuller. We want fullness. Just let me out. Let me go. No one could carry this. No, man. Can I? Am I actually a guitarist? Let me go. No one could carry.
What? I said this is not. Oh, no. Tomorrow is Blood Coast Fierce. Oh yeah, as I've established earlier in the stream, tomorrow is a pretty big gig for me, and I do not want the event planners to see this and go, "Oh, he's doubting himself." Oh, it's the not Sonic just Air. A big day for you. It's a big day for me. Oh, she's going to the gig as well. Sonic Air Bubble noise as also an excellent notification noise. Uh, notification tone. What is it? Sure, when twenty twenty. Nice. Those of you to join us. Um, uh, do, 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 where, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. Let me go. No. Yeah. Let me go. No one could carry this burden. Oh, come on. Let me go. No. Almost there. Let me go. No one could carry this. Yes. Let I'll do it, okay. Let me go. No one could carry these burdens I hold. Good. Let me go. No one could. Let me go. No one could carry these burdens I hold. Let me go. Harmony. I think they should. Don't hit yourself on my guitar. My guitar is very expensive. <laughs> I knew it. Go! No one could carry these burdens. I What'd you say? I said I decided what time he wants to rehearse yet. He has not messaged me yet, so um So if he messages me well, it's, it's, it's still fairly early. And he's obviously not watching this because he's mixing at the moment. The, uh, Ray Klein is the artist I'm performing with tomorrow. He's finalizing the tracks. And uh, we were going to rehearse at some point. He's like, listen, man, are you fine if I let you know when I'm ready? And I'm like, well, then I'm going to jump on stream. So I might be late. Is he going to come here or are you going to go there? Over there. Go! No one could carry these burdens I hold. What chord did I play there? Mortar. Okay, that's that A minor I recorded. It's a bit of a risky move. Clean break. Should I? I think I should build that a bit more, a bit more chug. I think I should do some chugs there. What did I want? Stupid, stupid, stupid. Yeah. There's my Samsung alarm as we speak. That's annoying. Bling blong, bling blong, bling, bling blong, bling blong, bling, bling blong. Where's that uh where's that first course? I'm gonna copy path stuff. As I've said before in the stream, some people have this like. Understand, there is no plan, no help of this like issue with copy pasting, and it depends on the genre. Sometimes I I will admit, play it play it every time. Like 
because there's subtle differences. But in certain genres, you know, I work hard to get that take. You you were here. Take it over and over and over again. So if that take is good, leave it. Don't throw it away. Little trick. The one that was on the left earlier is now on the right, and the one that's on the right earlier was now on the left. So it does give a little bit of freshness. Sad, there is no plan, no help on the way. With each passing day, I carry this and and I'm alone. Trying to survive, God, I so there's a little variation. Stop with back the yeah, soy the soy sauce that. and the dumpling i don't have a glass yet you don't know you have a cool glass. I, I have a little bit of left but it's not gonna last me the whole stream okay that's fair cheers i have another one of these in the fridge but i, f I forgot you don't like them i bought them for you but why didn't you just get me a power one i forgot these are on special why didn't you just give me an egg those were on shade? promotion <laughs> <laughs> Get a little bit of chunky, chunky metal metals in there. Okay, let's try that again. the one. Gotta admit, the seven string is so much fun. This would be so much fun to play live as well. Um... That's why I wanted to record with the seven strings. I knew at some point I'm going to be able to just smack that low B. Um. Did a really cool drum fill there. Uh. I'm gonna do something a little more. It's 
It's gonna be hidden in the mix, but it'll make me feel better that I did a cool Octavi thing. <laughs> You're a fan of salmonella. <laughs> this one tastes of salmonella. But no, it's not salmon. That's hilarious. So if I was live, I'd, I'd play it. <laughs> Lol. What do you want to watch on so show, Max? I can't say, Steve. Oh. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna be pretty. Fat break there with the drums as well. Big bass drop. I don't want to go too shreddy. I want to go very melodic for the solo. Ooh, how do you feel about some kill switch action? Uh, what key are we in? <laughs> um, I'm going to do a naughty trick. And um, I want to... sense in a second look at that it'll make six in a second what i didn't say anything i didn't say anything hmm? nothing what did you say nothing what did you say nothing R rude things what did you say something about intercourse <laughs> why i don't know Cancel culture gone mad, quite frankly. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, live, I would actually use the kill switch and do the cool digga 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 thing. Like the. Oh, drop and pick. Give me a sec. Give me 15 minutes to drop. I'm so sorry, I stabbed you. I am. I That's am why dead. I, I have an ace guitar, sir. Uh. Dangerous because the pointy heads. Um, usually, I would go like live. I do the cool s channel Tomorello. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, that's exactly the vibe I wanted to go for with the kill switch thing. Live, I would. That's what I wanted here. Tomorello. That's where I saw Tomorello as a strat with his like right here, and. <laughs> That's what it's called in the biz. Yeah, nice. I'm just a little. I need more digga digga diggies. I need even more digga digga diggies. Is 
is this gap maybe too long and is this is this maybe inappropriate for the genre well uh friggin poop in one hand and ask that question in another and see who gives a poop is that how that expression goes um but yeah for production i like to really tweak the kill switch thing um because i find it makes it more effective if i can make it faster in the beginning yeah 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 and i'm gonna add some shreddy real shreddy guitar over that uh so we what we what we've got so far Exactly what I want. I want to go there. That's what I want. Yeah, yeah. That's kind of the solo already. Something, something to that effect. Uh. That's too high, that's unfortunately. I'll get it, I'll get it. It's too high. Something like that. That's kind of got the vibe I'm looking for. Yeah, okay, I, I I get the kill uh, I <laughs> kill switch engage. I honestly completely missed that. That's but that is where they got the name. Uga, uga, uga. Um, and he used that quite a bit with his time with his kill switch engage. Do they still exist? Because I know he's doing a lot of things. Uh, the new old ESP Tom Morello plugin, for example. Um, uh, and I've heard some of his solo stuff. I don't know. Does Kill Switch uh, engage? He has a different project now. I'm pretty sure. Uh. <laughs> the one. 
Tom. Listened to quite a bit of Kill, Kill Switch Engage back in the day. Um. You take my hand, here we go. You mm. help me. That's pretty. Let's do that second second half of rhythm guitars. I got carried away with the solo. Let's quickly make that drum. I think I'm going to keep it simple. Uh, the way I think that it would go live is just do do, you know, like just a big double hit um, with a big gap and like yeah, that's a great moment. I don't want to. There's already a lot of big. I'm tempted to cut off this kill switchy stuff. Now I'm mad at myself. Um, let's hear what it sounds like without that. Mm, let's have it softly in the background. So. Uh, people in the chat, should I have the kill switchy because I like the idea initially let's just hear that was just the drums and the rhythm guitars um. it sounds really cool but Everything together with like the context of the acoustic and the lead and everything I'm feeling without the I feel like that that hits so much harder. It's fine. I, I always say this and and it's gonna become a bit of a, a, a mantra uh, Rather record it have it if it ends if you end up not needing it. That's fine. You've recorded it, so if you end up do need if 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 I do end up needing it, I was like, oh, that break needs something. I don't want to be the guy who deleted it because I thought it wasn't necessary. Let me quickly color code this a little. It's starting to look ugly on stream. Lead guitars, I like me lead guitars. Let's make it. What color is the guitar? Is like a brownish yellowish color. Let's make it that color. It works for me. Let's listen to that solo.
I agree. The space is better. Should I just have maybe a... I'm sorry, this is noise. Chuck Chucks. Nah, complete, just drums. I want to do a little bit of a lead-in, but that space is better. I want to do a little bit of a... Yeah, something like that into it. something to that extent. there. Then I shut my Thank you for joining us. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm definitely loving that break. I might, I might actually take away the double, like the the second hit of the toms. I might just make it one clean uh, snare. Yeah. Maybe I'll do like a bass drop. You know, some th thick bass moment there. Um, something in that line uh where are we next what's next what's next what's next what's next? Uh... oh yeah you understand the big um uh and i will always love you moment <laughs> that's what i'm kind of aiming for oh. channel excuse
excuse me. You understand, came with the plan. Hold me to my feet, save me from me. I didn't know. I would. Mm, I need to. Something like that. Let's let's see where we get, end up. You understand? Came with the plan. Hold me to my feet. Save me from me. I didn't know. I I'm not a hundred percent sure yet. You understand? Came with the plan. Hold me to my feet. Save me from me. I didn't. I'm almost there. I just need to figure out exactly what notes I need. Save me from me. Oh, save me from me. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's pretty. Let's see if we can do that. That's kind of cool. Save me from me. I did. From me. I did. And then on the uh, Thank you so much, Jim Stool. Thank you so for for saying it's it's cool. I'm I'm loving where this is heading. Oh, I just noticed my camera went off. Excuse me. Can still hear me. I'm quickly gonna remedy the situation. While I fix that, listen. To, let's listen to the song. So far. May I have one of my dumplings? If you, do you want all three? Sure. Yeah. Okay. Actually, give me one, more, and then you can have the rest. Um. See, I was an idiot. I was just playing the music in the background, so I could have had an opportunity to eat. <laughs> Yeah. 
That's very Breaking Benjamin, and I'm fine with it. Exactly sure where to land with that one. Mm. Yeah, maybe back on that note. Play octaves. Yeah, no, I'm just gonna do single notes. There's the that's the one. That's the one, boys. I want the note to ring. to work let's do this enough listening let's make music Feed, save me from me. Uh, I need to find a harmony for that <laughs> jump ahead and do that first just cuz I'm scared I, I lose it understand came with the plan Hold me to my feet save me from me I didn't know mm. understand came with the plan Hold me to my feet save me from me I didn't know that's perfect Of the rest of that, um. you understand, came with the plan. Hold me to my feet, save me from me. I love those little moments of 2003 metalcore popping in. Um. You understand, came with the plan. Hold me to my feet. Oh, uh, Jim, uh, yeah, Joanna's not like here, unfortunately, but she is. Here in the green, this is you. You understand? Came with the plan. What I'm very fortunate, uh, like in my line of work, the fact that I'm able to collaborate with a person who lives in a different country, because uh, Joanna is uh, from the states, and I live here in Central South Africa, and that is crazy to me, because as I've mentioned earlier on the stream, when I was when I was a young warthog and I was just getting into music, the idea of being able to collaborate with people on the other side of the globe was just not a thing. It just did not exist. Um, and the fact that I'm able to make music with people uh, with such a it, it's such a with such a different lived experience uh, means that I believe a lot every country's music. 
will become better and better over years because a lot of um, what I've learned as a South African musician in regards to like a lot of the traditional music in my country and stuff, it's possible for me to pass that on not only to people in my country but people outside of South Africa. And the same with uh, the very rich kind of subgenres within Americana. You can hear I'm very influenced by blues. There's a sneaky blues lick I didn't even realize was in there in the snow solo. But a lot of Afrikaans music, uh, like, I don't know what, what Afrikaans, like, it's an, uh, Afrikaans is a language, not a genre. I try, but like a lot of dance music in my uh, kind of culture is very country influenced. And when I started writing country music, a lot of people were like, mm, you write country music? I don't know about that. Because they associate country with a very specific thing. A lot of people do. But I was like, but you're, you're dancing to Nona, which is like one of our biggest hits in South Africa. It is a full on dance song, but the guitar, the, but the guitar part is just country. Yes, it has a, it's like pop country, but from a guitarist perspective, I'm just like, it's clear where the producers got that. Anyway, my point is, I love that we live in a time where it is possible for people to collaborate um, the world over. Anyway, let's get back to this. You understand, came with no plan, hold me to my feet, save me from me, from me. I didn't know, I was never alone. Back to the minor, okay. I did that cool thing uh, again where I, I like to like it's not just for for coolness it's I, I want to get into that hope that the where it's yes put a bit of Kurt Darren in there uh, the, the, like, you know just for fun uh, where's my, where's my that's just for fun let me get my Kurt Darren tone up in here this is this is exactly Fleurs, the, the the producer who produces almost all of Afrikaans music. Um, he is just a country guitarist. He can pretend he's not, but he just is. Uh, Fleurs is just a country guitarist, and he can pretend he's not. Yeah, that's the one. My favorite riff to like meme on at rehearsals. Um, and you... Anyway, enough wasting time. Let's get back to work. I should have had a guitar with single coils. Jim, she was in the chat earlier. I don't. Oh, oh yeah. Uh, I do realize this stream has been going on. How long has the stream actually been going on? Oh, almost three. Almost two and a half hours. That is, I think that's the, the big thing. When I started this, I was like, there's no way I'm going to be able to keep this under four hours. I didn't know. Just because of the nature of what we do here. This is like almost a full day's you know, work. Like on, on an average day, if I'm tracking songs, I will often do two or three of these song, kinds of songs. But obviously, more than 40% of this is me talking. So I, sometimes I'll have to make the decision, am I going to stream something and take four hours or am I going to quickly, am I going to record it and work really hard and take two or three hours? Anyway, let's get back into it. Um, enough talk. Talk is cheap. Came with the plan. Hold me to my feet. Save me from me. I didn't know. I was never alone. Came with the Get 
those jugs tighter. I didn't know. I can definitely get those chugs to be a bit better on the second attempt. that to be nice and nice. Um. Ah, almost, almost, almost. Oh, we're leading back to the... I can do that better. Add some like a guitar feeding in the background there. Add some some light. Aggressive 80s feedback is definitely gonna add a lot to that. Um, I didn't notice you were at the sand I got. I didn't, I'm sorry. You understand, came with the plan. Let's get some leads. You understand, came with the plan. The one. You understand, came with the plan Hold me to my feet, save me from me I didn't know I, I didn't know I was never Just wanted that one chord uh, You know, it's a bit 
generic literally just needed that one note Some big shrugs. Never alone. What key am I in? Sorry. something I like most of that I just flubbed that one note completely that note completely let's see if that works it's quite uh, brian may from queen vibe i've been listening to a lot of queen i'm going to be performing a gig with arku and <laughs> okay i think we're pretty much done with the acoustics um, just want to double check something. Um, do 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 do. Cool. Um. <laughs> to solo over especially with those little extra notes so little trick for if you want to create feedback but you don't actually have a speaker to feed back to if you're using plugins you're going through headphones and we're gonna need a big reverby I would almost say two reverb um. now I'm gonna record a couple of notes as much sustain as possible. Oh yeah, you wanted to bring the one the rat with an eye infection on stream. I would have been was, a little upset. I was tempted, and then I was like, nah, this is like that Creed 4 Toad thing. I think um, it's worse. So I just had it, momentarily, I had it. He's cute otherwise. He's, he's one of my favorites, but Not you sure. can't bring a rat with a, a face infection. I think, I, like, like if, I think if the camera close gets a close-up of that, they, the, the stream might get killed. <laughs> to record um, okay, cool. okay so now we've got our building blocks for a yummy feed now usually I would render this out with the delay and stuff but I want it to be as natural as possible so first things first let's reverse all this now we've got A 
that's already something. Let's add some of this. We're getting there. Let's add some of this. That's the wrong plugin. Let's let's add this one. I'll add this one with lots of reverb as well. And you can get interesting tones here because with natural feeding, um, it's just feeding into the actual overtones of the chord you're playing. But you can get, if you want to add an overtone that isn't actually in the chord. <laughs> That one's a bit aggressive, I would say, for me. It's coming in a little hot. And now, you cut off the transient, the, the thing that's actually making the noise. One of our neighbors just came home singing, can't take my eyes off of you. Wow, somebody's in love. <laughs> anyway, now we fade everything. Or they watched, um, or they watched 10 Things I Hate About You. That's also possible. Let's hear what this sounds like. Uh, they something else with that act. And that reminded them of. They watched the Batman and then, like, you know. Anyway. What's making that noise? I don't know. I'm not talking to you. Okay. I'm. I'm. You know. I'm. Yeah, I, I'm actually. Logically, yeah. if you're sitting next to me and going, "What's making that noise?" Obviously, you're not talking. Okay. To that. Me. Okay. That was. I'll be honest. That is quite. <laughs> That is quite reasonable to assume I'm talking to you. I, I'll, I'll, I, I can acknowledge that. That was not a bad call on your part. <laughs> one of these is not sounding nice. I think it's this one. Yeah, I don't like that one. You know that's a copyrighted song. Oh, what was that? Hi, Dad. I seem to find my. It's that one. That's enough. Uh, like that's that you don't you don't need too much. Just a little bit, and just for it to resonate out and you fade it out again. Like that one might already be too much. Yeah, just a little bit. Just a little. Bit. That's that's enough for me. That's pretty. Now, welcome back, Joanna. Had a meeting. Look at you being a, a full adult. Um, every now and then I'll have a meeting. And then it's just... Uh, like somebody wanted to see me for like five seconds to discuss something and it's like I, I, I didn't even take a briefcase so I feel like I'm a fraud if I tell people I have meetings because it's sort of I sort of don't <laughs> in fact actually listen to the full song I'm going to back out the other guitar
This is a bop, guys. I'm gonna add some clean electric. We haven't even done bass yet. How long have we been streaming, actually? Uh, just under for three hours. That's good for guitars. Like, you know, three hours for just guitars. I'm happy with that. <laughs> Let's get some tuning up in here. Um, ciao. See you all later. Thank you so much for joining us, Space Town. Uh, look, looking forward to seeing you again. Uh, as I've mentioned, people, I keep most of these streams will go up and stay up indefinitely. The only reason I really take a stream down is if some horrifying, uh, like technical difficulty happens, and um, some like a really bad technical difficulty. Um, there's only been one or two of those. Generally, I don't take a stream off once it's on. Um, anyway, let's record some clean electrics. Uh, let's make a tone. I have a, a preset that I quite like for this one. No, sorry, that's not the one. Factory artist is Jack Gardner's Mayorish. Yes. 
I definitely need some lemmy bass up in up in this. I think definitely when I perform do bass, I'm gonna do it with a pick. I want that slightly aggressive. You know, it's a very dark tone from this amp, especially with with this guitar. Um, maybe a bit cleaner. I think we should go a tad uh, cleaner. Um, drive. No, no drive. Compression. That with a lot of extra reverb. Yeah. And some dotted eight delays. Let's do that. Yeah, that'll be the tone. Um. I made a mistake. Made another mistake. say I'm gonna make a clean like a clean lead track just to add one little little reference like a, 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 a sneak gain on that one. Let's hear it though. So just sort uh, uh, arts um, comment. If I had a twelve string, like I do like that the tuning I like the tuning I use through the acoustics. Um, not tuning the the chord shapes. Of those, that kind of open chordy thing, and I for, for like the left I'll sometimes go. Uh, down and the other one I'll go up. That's kind of the Nashville twelve string thing. Where you, I love the twelve string. It is sad that very few people play the twelve string. Um, it's one guy I know has a twelve string, but I'm considering turning one of my uh, doing the the Nashville twelve string thing, which is you take the higher set of the twelve, you know, the the six octave upstrings, tune that like take that and put that on acoustic guitar, so the whole acoustic is tuned an octave up. So then you record with the normal acoustic and you were trying to record the exact same thing on that octave up acoustic. It sounds incredible. And apparently a lot of the good, like classic 12 string stuff, Hotel California, that kind of stuff. That's how they did it in the studio. Live, they play on a, a 12 string, but it's like d d trying to double it nearly perfectly. And then you can double that with a 12 string as well. I just don't own one. My dad has a beautiful 12 string that unfortunately um like it just aged and the soundboard broke so like the it's it's beyond repair now it's just a like a, a like a like an antique like a thing that's pretty but i think that was his first big like guitar he bought himself um and i will definitely be buying a mandolin soon i uh 
Really? I, yeah, no, the second I can justify buying another oh, really? Switch. Really? Yes, because you've discussed that so extensively with your wife. I have said, I've, I've said I want to buy you a have, Banjo. I and, literally, I've, and I literally said, like, you can get a mandolin on the condition that you also buy a Banjo. No, I think you said I can buy a Banjo on the condition that I also buy a mandolin, didn't no, I? No, no. The, the other, other way around, other okay. Way around. Um, yeah, I want to buy myself a lap steel, like a, like a, for, especially because I do a lot of country session work and sometimes like I do play slide uh, the occasional slide riff uh, does this song need slide um. I'll think about it I have to change the tuning so I'm not gonna do that now but I'm definitely gonna think about it um, um. I will tell her. Yeah, yeah. It's it's Art's fault that I'm buying a mandolin. So it's I. I it's not, his fault. Uh, Art Art Ray is he's, he's in the chat. I just I can't do anything about it. Um, is it his fault? Oh yeah, Jimmy Page had that twelve like double neck thing. Um, oh yeah, I haven't seen a twelve string electric, pretty much since that. I think it's like an SG shape, um, electric with a twelve string. I have not so seen one of those. What's in Art's long. address so I can have a chat with him? <laughs> Eugene, all songs need slide. I tend to agree. Hey, I think, well, es your... especially in these like clean sections. Look at me having to maybe do slide. Maybe not tonight. Um, plus, I'm really insecure about my slide playing. Um, not that I need to be, but um, it's a different thing. Like to be good at slide. <laughs> is playing video games while I'm working. Um, you know, because I was so lazy this week. For the first, absolutely nothing for the first time, there, there seems to be a, a disagreement in the chat in regards to whether or not the song needs slide, <laughs> um, which I do appreciate. Uh, yeah, I'll try and figure out. Let's get back to the clean electric because that it does need. <laughs> I realize it's very quiet in the mix. Um, let, turn, let me turn down the electric guitars a little. Um. Like the captain said on one of your yeah. friends. And then his friend's like, oh my what? god, it's your captain. Your captain, yeah. You've been dreaming of this forever. It's so cute. Um, Such a wholesome game. Uh, what was I going to say? Uh, I can't remember what I was going to say now. Um, like, such a wholesome game. Now, where's that bottle? Um, <laughs> as usual, my wife interrupts. Technically, I'm working. You know that, right? Technic yeah, even sorry. though I'm mostly having fun. I don't think it's Doubt that Joanna can growl. Not no shade to her. She's an incredible musician. Uh, triads in the verses. Good idea. No. Um, <laughs> but I do love a good female like guttural vocal. That is one of my favorite things. A dream. Shush. Um, th that sounded really harsh. I apologize. I'm not going to dignify that with this. <laughs> Here in a dream, I lie awake in bed. Sunrise and sets, I'll stay here in my head. The day. 
I did a very pretty thing on the acoustic. I should turn that up. In my head, the um. Yeah, something like that. I'll stay here in my head the day. used to the seven string and that's i wanted to play it like a seven string drainer will get you there, but don't swallow you know i would never say that uh well smoke some cigarettes goggle bleach that's a dangerous way to try and get there that is not how you do that i have a good friend who's a, a vocal a vocalist in a metal band um uh and it's actually like it's an incredible technique i've said this a lot but like i know to a lot of people it's like it just sounds like noise but to be able to get that sound out of you it comes from the diaphragm not the throat so a lot of time when people emulate it they hurt themselves but uh all of that like the that growl comes from the uh, diaphragm it's a lot like operatic singing i used to practice it in 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 high school because i really wanted to be in a metal band um and that kind of fell by the way why sad <laughs> Yeah, metal vocals are amongst the most challenging to be to get good at. Um, I always recommend if you want to check out an incredible vocalist, um, uh, the band that uh, one of their big songs is Doomsday. Um, uh, let me just look that up. Doomsday. I'm sure that uh, Architects. Architects. Go check out Architects. Doomsday. He does this beautiful, like, I'm not even sure how he does it, but he basically does, um, yeah, definitely, uh, Joanna, go check out Dooms Doomsday by Architects. He does this thing where he sings basically a melodic, he activates the fry vocal, so he gets that guttural sound, but it has pitch. It's like, what will be, will be, like, he, he's able to get that vocal fry within pitch so like ah, like it's crazy and then he does the low scary growly stuff as well but um same with the lead vocalist from uh lamb of god's Sepul sepultura i haven't listened to a lot of their stuff i should check out uh, more of sepultura i know maybe one or two songs um but what's wrong no i was at your room where i wanted to play something earlier than oh yeah here, so i'm just waiting for mm -hmm. So I'm really glad I'm playing the Assassin's Creed game tomorrow, mm -hmm. but I really miss uh, Valhalla because mm. I was seeing Kenway's tattoos mm. and I was like, I must be another trip around here. Mm. Those are love tattoos. That could get you missed. The, like my wife is playing through um, uh, the Assassin's Creed franchise, and she's decided to bite the bullet and play the older ones with, with video get where with movies yeah because it's so torturous to play but, all oh, the they're fun. Creatures. they're fun but like <laughs> with movies a lot of people are like oh yeah but the first one's unbeatable you can't beat the first one but with video games that's almost never true the sequels are almost always better um oh joanna's bodyguard slash roadie now now i now i get it yeah um uh well, the thing is like I've really gained an appreciation for the Assassin's Creed franchise since mm. I started, since I replayed it. And, like, the first one is a bit of a slog, but when you get to number two... It's, yeah, no, it's excellent. from two on, everything's excellent. Like, yeah, but... Um, you know this is a stream about songwriting and, and guitar. Yeah, and my, my, my podcast is a podcast about rats and everything else that you bring up. Fair enough. <laughs> um, anyway, as I was saying... Uh, good job, Art. <laughs> um, I can't help you with that one. Um, what was I going to say? Uh, do -do 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 -do. Um, something about vocals. But yeah, oh, Periphery. Periphery is another band where their lead vocals, uh, vocalist does an incredible job blending between clean vocals, uh, vocal fry stuff, and then insane, terrifying growls. But he blends them. So he does this really cool combination of different styles um 
uh, motion sickness. I've heard that's a big problem for a lot of people. Um, I get a little bit of a motion sickness every now and then with like VR. I don't own a VR headset, but I, I have a friend who does, and like I like I'm I don't have my sea legs <laughs> for 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 that uh, just yet. Um, but yeah, since it, and this is gonna show like I'm I'm coming, speaking from a point of privilege because I do something really fun for a living. A lot of people assume. Oh, like I'm just basically always doing my hobby because music used to be the hobby, but now that music's the job, I needed a hobby, like an active hobby, that I can still do something that wasn't music. So video games really provides me with a, like a, a something else, a, a, a breakaway from that. Um, anyway, I'm wasting time. Let's do this. I'll stay here in my head. The days come. Jump back on the pick now. I'll stay here in my head. The days come and go. The time moves so slow. Just let me out. Let Ooh, I forgot I did that cool, uh, like dotted eight thing on in the lead. Um, that's fun. Uh, let's get that back. Rise and set. I'll stay here in my head. The day is come. Something like that. Rise and set. I'll stay here in my head. The day is come. Yeah, so I, like, I want to get some. Steak. Rise and set. Before I'll stay one. here in my head. The day is come. Rise and set. Turn works. Yeah. Rise and set. I'll stay here in my head. The days come and go. The time moves so slow. Just let me. Just let me out, let me go. No one could carry these burdens alone. You don't understand, there is no plan, no hope. These they can't be fixed. My reflections are happy. Person that I miss, and I can't. So, for that verse, the the second verse, I still want some clean guitar, but I want to get that um, kind of ambient, I keep saying proggy, that's not necessarily the word, um, but yeah, you know, like how gent bands will have this like insane amount of delay. <laughs> that's not enough delay. Um, Used to be into heavy Call of Duty, but Call of Duty, I think it was, started to get sick. Yeah, no, I like I've heard of people. The motion sickness does get to a lot of people. Um, again, again, I'm, I guess I'm, I'm, I'm fortunate not to have that problem. Uh, you know what, Tim Henson. This is also a great plugin for everyone. Like if you're into guitar plugins, the archetype Tim Henson is great for that kind of more modern almost poppy guitar like especially the clean is very crystalline and glossy glossy is a nice description for that um geez i hope it opens um when's the last time i hit save <laughs> um eugene has a good point nice idea for the bendy lick but perhaps save it for the second verse i'm scared there's no room in the second verse because I already started getting aggressive in the second verse. Um, I'm a little worried about this plug, uh, like this plugin, like, um, I'm, 
honestly slightly worried. You can't see my mouse cursor, but that, oh, that is terrifying. Please don't crash. Please don't crash. I cannot afford a crash right now. Um, I'm going to be very upset if this crashes now. <laughs> Um, oh no, oh no, please, I've been working all night, please, no, <laughs> um, oh no, oh no, <laughs> no, I can't force quit, no, show me the plugins, can I? Oh no, no, the, oh no, the plugin crashed. No, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, oh, it's still there. Oh, I can't, oh, I just had a heart attack. Oh. Um, remove, remove effects, remove um, selected effects. That hasn't happened before. Maybe there's specifically wrong something wrong with my install of the archetype Tim Henson. Yeah, it's doing like okay, I just I did just hit save. There it is. That's fine. Wow, I think I almost just had a heart attack. I cannot afford to have lost any amount of the work I did tonight. Um As I was saying, the archetype Tim Henson is excellent for like um poppy guitars it has a really cool like vocoder this thing the the multi-voicer is really cool uh, but what i want to use it for right now is just the delay reverb and maybe a little bit of the chorus <laughs> shimmer effect and i quite like that so i'm gonna add a little bit of that shimmer and some of the kind of modern reverb and uh, like a modern delay sound um <laughs> yeah maybe maybe the shimmer maybe not so much but we'll see Now the electric guitars aren't working. I'm gonna have a heart attack. I'm gonna have a heart attack. Um. Oh. You guys are right here on the ground floor of. Why is the electric guitar not working? None of the electric guitars are working. Okay, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. That, that's very unfortunate. Um, the plugins crashed because I was very happy with that guitar tone. You might remember. Um, if I replace the effect, do you think it will remember the preset? Command S every 30 seconds, you're 100% right. That is a, that is how you're supposed to do it. And I think I do generally. It did not remember my presets. I think... Okay, that's fine. I know I know my lead tone fairly well. Uh, let's see how good I can get that back. Dotted 8 delay. Um, ping pong. Modulation sync. Sync... Uh, Where's my uh, time? Dotted eight. Rev little bit of reverb. That should be my lead tone. I'm just gonna fix this quickly. This sounds pretty close. Oh no, it's not. It's it was it was on this one. Let's hear that. 
was on. I'm just gonna go ahead and save all my presets. Um, the drama, my emotions are on a roller coaster. Yeah, no, same. Okay, cool. It is unfortunate that None of my, uh, like, I think, was I on the, who, like, for those who've been watching from the beginning, I believe I was on the archetype, like, the nolly. Oh, you, ooh. You yeah. Mmm. Mmm. I think I was on metal rhythm. Was I? I can't remember. Did I make my own rhythm? I can't remember. No, I wasn't. I was on... Um, classic crunch, perhaps. Let's listen to that if that sounds correct. <laughs> That's not it. Um, guys, I'm I'm freaking out, but I don't remember. I'm washed out, hot rod, heaven, classic crunch. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'll, I'll be honest, when I mix, when I'm mixing this, I'll try and kind of fix, I'll, you know what, I'll probably just go back, you know, that's, okay. No reason to stress, because I can just go watch this stream and go see exactly what my, I, I was stressing, but I, that's the benefit of recording what you're doing, is now I can go back and see exactly what my tone was no stress we are all good thank you all of you for standing by as i nearly had a heart attack as i thought i lost everything um let's check is your vocal yeah all the effects even your vocal um yeah even the vocal effects for some reason disappeared that's a weird glitch hey that's not happened to me yet um hey is coming and the drums are fine um yeah drums are fine and the uh this plugin suite the the virtual mix rack from slide digital that's fine but the reverb i put on isn't let me put that back waves uh, CLA, yeah, that's weird. But anyway, thank you for everyone for sticking with me through this horrifying event on tonight's stream. I'm so um. Let me out, let me go. No one could carry these burdens I hold. You don't understand. Control S. I'm, I'm sorry, by the way. Uh, Command S. Yeah, yeah. I forgot for a second I'm a, I'm a Mac user now. <laughs> mm. Okay. We are back on track. That was a terrifying 10 or 20 minutes. Um, what time is it? Okay, it's not that. Now let's get back to that ambient tone that almost ruined my night. Because I still want to do it. 
I feel like I'm in an abusive relationship with uh, that plugin now. Um. <laughs> Very softly in the background. I don't want it to take any attention. Something in that vein. Mm -hmm. He has, but I'm on stream, so I'm not going to listen to a voice note now. Uh, yeah, sure, if you want. I can't even voice that as a Christine was this. That's really funny. Like I'm serious, that's not her profession. I I live at real. I um uh circumstances arose that are beyond his control. Doesn't matter. Let's get some tune up in here. Let's tune. Uh, a little piece of advice: don't tune on the second plugin. Because that's gonna mean that you're gain, like you're gonna have gain before the tuner, and you don't want that, because that will affect your tone and tuning ability. Okay. Um. Get back to that first section. sound quite aggressive just be very soft in the background with even more reverb and delay um, very quiet in the background some cleans again we need some cleans up in here you take my hand here we go you help me carry these burdens I hold you take my hand here we go you help me carry these burdens I hold
that sounds like in that my hand here we go you help me carry these burdens i hold Ambience on that last chorus. I want the last chorus to feel a bit bigger. You understand? Came with the plan. Pull me to my feet. Save me from me. I didn't know. I was never alone. That the, the pick sound because the attack of the pick I don't want I just want like this single sound Understand, came with the plan. let's listen to this because I'm I'm excited about this now
Take my hand, here we go. You help me carry these burdens I hold. You understand, came with the plan. Hold me to my feet, save me from me. I didn't know I was never I can eat a dumpling on stream. I can't eat uh, chicken stew on, on stream. I feel like that's that's gonna get in my beard. I need, I need a big uh, snare hit in that moment. Um, flam. I'm loving this song. I'm feeling pretty good about it. Now, final. Ba those who are still here, um, I did confirm by the way that this new video is still new. This is where Sean actually is. Um, um, sorry, I lost my train of thought. Um, what was I saying? How long have we been streaming? Heading on four hours. I think we still have time for bass. So I'm going to get my bass. I should have gotten the bass while I was listening, but I wasn't sure if I wanted to do bass on stream now. But I believe I still have time. I'm going to get my bass out. Um, again, a lovely opportunity for those who are in the in chat. Um, definitely pop off recommendations. If there's anything specifically people want to see on these streams, you can tell me in the comments. I know I definitely want to do like let's, more let's original a, songwriting. Let's, yeah. Let's make an old an old joke. How much for you to take your shirt off? Uh, genuinely, if I reach a thousand subscribers within the next week. No, no, no. You have to put money. I have to put yeah, money. To put if somebody money. donates, no, you don't take your you don't take your clothes off for subscribers. Okay. If somebody donates, what's? Uh, but you're gonna have to get super a, chats first. A thousand. I was gonna say rand. That's not that much. In in like. Uh, how is, American how is money. secure are you to take your shirt off? I will never take my shirt off. Okay. <laughs> so I want it like hundred thousand dollars. That's that's the price. <laughs> I, d I don't want to take my shirt off. Let's get a nice semi-aggressive bass tone. Um, I've been using, I mentioned this in the last stream, but I've been using this um, uh, bass, deep and dark bass. I think that's the one. Uh, no, no, bread and butter bass. Yeah, maybe the gritty rock bass. Let's... There's that. Yeah. It's not really appropriate for this genre, so I'm gonna go bread and butter bass for now, and then we can we can adjust tone later. That's not important for now, but because I need you need a bass tone. That's nice for the chill sections as well as the heavy sections. Uh, but within the mix, you can you can always have a second bass. Like you can parallel process it with some gain on it. No, nope. don't want that lower octave.
get that. Do you got to? Yeah, something like that. Something, something like that. Yeah. Loads of fun, yeah. and tight with that. Here in a, here in a dream. I'll get nice and tight with that um kick. I'm gonna turn the, the drums up a little bit. They're getting nice and loud now. I'm gonna turn everything down a little. Don't wanna get too loud. Thank you, Lauren, for, for, for throwing a little Afrikaans in there. I appreciate that. Here in a dream, I lie awake in bed. I don't want to miss that groove. I was very proud of that groove when I programmed it, and now I keep missing it. I lie awake in bed. Something I, I'm not exactly sure. I'm I lie awake in bed. Sunrise. Going down to that low B is always really fun. Again, Again I know I've said it a million times, but I almost feel like five strings should be the minimum for bass. And then you could go up to a six string if you want to be crazy. Idea, leave the first verse without bass. You read my mind, Eugene. I thought that might be, like, I, a part of me, I considered it, and I was scared that it might be, but leave the first one without bass. You know what, you genuinely, you read my mind. Here in a dream, I lie awake in bed, sunrise, there, but, but very, awake in bed, sunrise, my chords there in my head I'll stay here in my head the days come I'll stay here in my head the days come and go the time moves so keep forgetting my chords now. I'll stay here in my 
so freaking complicated that I can't go the time so back to a okay So I feel it feels nice and aggressive when I come in and I re record that. I'm not happy with that delivery. I'll stay here in my head. The day is. I'll stay here in my head. The day is come and go. The time moves so slow. Just let me. Big bass. Oh, so. Just let me out. Let me go. Should I come with oh, a so. Just let me out. Let me go. No one could catch. I just can't remember the chords. But I, I will say it's sort of my fault for playing on the seven string with a blow B. Going back to the sixth string and, uh, and jumping between now, my brain's not working. Let me out, let me go. No one could carry these burdens alone. Yeah. Let me out, let me go. No one could carry these burdens alone. You don't. to emphasize Tigrikaku. You don't understand. You don't understand. There is. That's the bass's job. It's actually just to like help the drummer. No it's other real. It, the the bassist has to emphasize the Tigrikaku. You don't understand. I believe that's a quote from Victor Wooten. You don't understand There is no plan No help on the way With each passing day I carry this And I'm alone How did oh, I... I almost had a cool bass run there Let's see if I can make that work Dad, there is no plan Simplify it. Uh, drummers need help. <laughs> drummers need help. <laughs> I'm kidding. Uh, but yeah, drummers. It's not that. Like, here's the thing. Drummers are fine without bassists, and bassists are fine without drummers. But shucks, nothing is as fun as a good bassist and a good drummer. When I when I go watch a live show and I see a good bassist and a good drummer. Giving some space for the electric, cause that this uh mm. now we got the second verse. 
I should switch the pick now. Just let Absolutely clean, no bass in that, no bass drop in there. You don't understand, there is no plan, no help on the... You don't understand, there is no plan, no help on the way, with each passing day, I carry this home, and I'm along with that. Uh, I think we go to E. I want I don't want to do the same as the guitar. That's that's cool.
but I know that I feel like there's an offbeat in the on the A that I didn't hit. So I wanna Yeah, I missed that a uh, bit quicker on the You take my hand, here we go. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Oh yes. You take my hand, here we go. You help me carry these burdens I hold. I feel like I definitely should do some of those notes, not the first two. I think I should land on that B. Here we go. You help me carry these burdens I hold. I want as much as possible to be there so that it can go away. These burdens I hold. I don't want that. But I do. Um, can I? Okay, yeah. figure out how to mute that naturally I don't want to just cut it off does that make sense um, again this is not how I would do this live I would just mute my string yeah you want I missed that. I wasn't. It felt like that's how I would do it live. If I missed that, I would, I would try and grab it. Oh, I thought I could do my open B. That's unfortunate. Let me just put a marker for myself there. Because, again, like, again, I would watch the drummer. Should I down tune my bass to get that low A? Or should I just play A? I think I'll just play A for now. Yeah, I think that's good. I'm, I was gonna down tune to drop A, but I think rather this. Ladies and gentlemen, Shana, thank you so much for joining me. Thank you so much for inviting me onto this song. Thank you for letting me take what is a perfectly good <laughs> piano ballad. <laughs> like, I don't want to take away from the original. The original is really good. Um, really enjoyable. But the amount of fun I had in the last four hours. Um... And I, I definitely like the direction of the bass. Um, I think I, I, I went more, like, a lot of the time with my guitar playing, I can't help myself. I went a little heavy in places. Um, and I think 
when when Arden mixes this, I do think I'm gonna let him mix it because he has a really good ear for this style. Um, unlike you. Unlike me, who sucks. Um, you understand? Came with the plan. Hold me to my feet. Save me from me. I didn't know. I was never alone. Never alone. That is insane. Um, yeah, with the bass, be I, I, because I feel like I'm a more mature bassist. That sounds super arrogant. I don't mean it that way. Um, on the bass, I, I aim to be more mature. That's maybe a better way to put it out. Not that I necessarily am, but I aim to make more appropriate decisions when I'm playing bass. So sometimes I'll be like, that's a bit much. Keep it back. But I won't do that for the guitar. Shall we have one final listen through? All the way through and I think then the song is like again obviously it's not mixed uh, you know what let's chuck a master chain on this uh, and see where that takes us um, I'll kind of mix it a little as we're going on um, but let's put a one of my like I, I have a, a mastering preset that I quite enjoy this will take it a lot of the way uh, uh, this is the uh, Abbey Road Studios Mastering Chain by Waves. I remember seeing one or two ads for this and going, that's exactly what I need. It's my pleasure. Thank you for sp uh, spiking up. You're very kind. I really <laughs> thank you. Um, thank you so much, Joanna, for, for the trust. Uh, that does mean a lot. Anyway, let's let's have a listen.
Take my hand, here we go. You help me carry these burdens I hold. You understand, came with the plan. Pull me to my feet, save me from me. I didn't know I was never So I just want just to say thank you so much, Eugene, for um, watching. Um, that's that's what this is all about, sharing the process. Yeah. Um, and thanks again to Joanna. This has been, I can I can unequivocally say this has been the most fun I've had on stream, without a shadow of a doubt. This is the most fun I've had on stream. Um, Thank you again to my lovely wife and producer for chiming in <laughs> occasionally. She's still there? Yeah. Um, and thank you for everyone yeah, for you, you focusing on things. Um, ah. I had an insane amount of fun. As I said, uh, uh, enjoy your meeting. <laughs> I keep forgetting uh, about the time zones things. Like, you have a meeting uh, almost 10 o'clock at night, but no, <laughs> I realize it's. Uh, it's reasonable time at, in the rest of the world. But thanks again for watching. That has been it. Uh, go check out some of our other streams. Go check out a video if you want. Uh, like and subscribe and hit that bell, especially, and put on notifications. So that if you want to see this kind of thing, you want to see more of my process in various genres, definitely pop in. A uh, million thank yous to everyone who was in the chat. Um, it makes it so much more fun for me to get interaction and get feedback and stuff. As I'm going, that's a lot of fun for me personally. That that has been it for today. Um, uh, hopefully, another new video with my, uh, featuring my wife, like a slop, yella, like a slop, Eugene. Um, hopefully, a new video out soon featuring my wife and uh, my wife. My wife. <laughs> and I had a lot lots of fun with this one. Um, sh I don't know when Lauren, uh, John, Joanna's going to release the song, so go follow her on her social media. And stuff to find T when this song comes out when she releases her next um, song. Uh, you can follow her at I don't want to lie about the Instagram handle, so I'm gonna quickly go double check while I'm here. You can go follow her on Instagram at um, uh, Joanna uh, dot Lauren S. I think if I got that Joanna dot Lauren dot S. Uh, she's Joanna Lauren music uh, sings on YouTube, and I unfortunately don't have TikTok anymore because uh, that app scares me. So I don't know what where she is on there, but you can follow links, and I'm gonna tag everything in the description of the stream. Thank you very much. As before, as I've said before, I have no idea how to end these, so I'm just gonna go ahead and leave. <laughs>